in seven games. And believe me, uh, you're, there's nothing going to stop you, and unfortunately. Now we're going to have a melee at center ice. Weber was getting called on Pasternak. Everyone's going to pile in. Gallagher goes down. He's all tangled up with DeBrusque, I believe. And everyone's got a dance partner here at center ice. You heard Tory Krug when he was talking to Sean McKenzie that, you know, he's not a wallflower. He, Pasternak will go into the tough areas. He will go at it. And you saw him with Gallagher, and you see him here with Weber. He's not going to shy away from it. Uh, the one thing was Weber, Weber had red brain, and there was no doubt about that. He drew the penalty on the interference call, and I was just about to say the one thing, too, that I really think has helped Montreal is they've really stayed out of the penalty box. His boss has got a, a real solid power play, and here Pasternak comes through, and there's the interference call, and Weber doesn't like it, but then Pasternak gives him a shove, and once he gives him the shove, watch Weber here. Oh, yeah? Well, I don't think so. And then the whole melee happens at center ice, and... And that's good pastor. I like it. I like the fact that this is a guy who leads the league in goals. He's a goal scorer, but he's also got a bit of edge to him. And that's probably why he leads the league in scoring. This is a guy like Krug said will go into the dirty areas. And I love the temperature of this game. You can feel the tension down here at the ice surface. You can see the players' faces. I mean, this is the way the Montreal-Boston game, what it normally looks like and feels like.